Hello everyone. Today I will explain how to import JSON file in Excel. Now before explaining the import process, let me share the basic information about JSON file. JSON stands for JavaScript Object Notation. It is a plain text format which is used to store and send the data. In JSON, data is in key value pair where key and value is separated by colon. Key is always in double quotes and value can be a string, boolean, number, object, array or null value. The different pairs are separated by comma. Curly braces hold objects and square bracket hold arrays. JSON file extension is .json. You can open the JSON file in Notepad or browser. To import JSON file in Excel, go to Data tab and in Get and Transform Data option, click on Get Data. Go to From File and select From JSON option. Now select the JSON file which you want to import and click Import button. It will open the Power Query Editor. Now click on Convert into Table option. Now all the key and value pairs are shown and it is showing the string, boolean, number, null values. Also the arrays is shown as list and objects are shown as record. Now go to transform tab and click on transpose option. First row is showing the header. So click use first row as headers option. So in the table address phone and car is showing value as record or list. Now for address, click on double arrow button. Now remove checkbox, use original column name as prefix. It is showing all the columns which are available in the address object. Click OK. All the values, street, city, state and postal code is now available as a different columns. Again for phone, click on double arrow button. It is showing two options, expand to new rows and extract values. So I'm selecting expand to new rows first. Now the value is showing as a record. Click on double arrow button again. It is again showing all the columns available in the phone. Make sure the checkbox use original column name as prefix is unchecked. Click OK button. The phone number home and office are shown as a different row. For car, again click on double arrow button and this time select extract values. All the cars are delimited by comma in the JSON file. So I'm selecting comma as a delimiter. Click OK. The car names are displayed in the car column. Now if you see the data, all the values are same except the phone number type and number select type column click on pivot column option now it will open pivot column dialog in values column select the number which is the phone number extend the advanced options and as we don't need the aggregate values so select don't aggregate option. Click OK. Now there is only single row available and the phone numbers. There are two separate columns. One is for home phone number and second is for office phone number. Go to home tab and click on close and load arrow key and select close and load to. Now in the import data dialog, table is already selected. New worksheet is already selected. You can select the existing worksheet and click OK. 
the data is imported in the Excel. So in this way, you can import JSON file in Excel. If you like the content, press thumbs up and share with your friends and colleagues. Subscribe the channel and press bell icon to get the notification of new videos. Thanks for watching.